Ah Xing had just graduated from high school. Without any special skills, he couldn't find a good job, so he decided to work as a technician in a factory for the time being. One rainy evening, as Ah Xing was about to ride his motorcycle home from work, he realized he had forgotten his raincoat. The sky was dark, and thunder rumbled in the distance. I'd better buy a disposable raincoat from the convenience store, he thought. As he ran out of the factory gates, a bolt of lightning suddenly struck him. Ah Xing collapsed unconscious on the spot. When he woke up, he found himself in a hospital bed. Fortunately, he hadn't suffered any serious injuries. He was discharged after a few days of rest. Soon after returning home, Ah Xing made an incredible discovery. His eyes could now see through objects, he had gained X-ray vision. In his room, he could see through the walls into the living room. He could even see through mahjong tiles and playing cards. He could also see into people's bodies, observing their bones and internal organs. At first, Ah Xing was terrified. But as the reality of his new power sank in, he became ecstatic. Why should I keep working at the factory, he thought. I could go to casinos and make a fortune. Indeed, Ah Xing's X-ray vision allowed him to win huge sums of money at the casinos. Eventually, the casinos banned him from entering, but by then, he had already made millions. With his newfound wealth, Ah Xing indulged in a life of excess. He spent his days eating, drinking, gambling, and visiting brothels. Sometimes, he would use his X-ray vision to peek at women's bodies on the street. He used his extraordinary ability purely for his own pleasure and gain. Though his life was filled with luxury and excitement, Ah Xing felt increasingly empty inside. He had no purpose or goals to strive for. One day, as he was wandering aimlessly down the street, he saw a middle-aged man approaching. Suddenly, the man twisted his ankle and fell to the ground, clutching his foot in pain. Out of curiosity, Ah Xing used his X-ray vision to examine the man's injury. It's just a sprained ankle, Ah Xing said, walking over to the man. There's no fracture. You should go to the nearby orthopedic clinic for treatment. The man looked at him skeptically. How do you know that? he asked, wincing in pain. Ah Xing hesitated for a moment, then replied, I... I've seen a lot of sprains before. Trust me, it's not broken. The man nodded slowly. Well, thank you for your help. I'll take your advice and visit the clinic. As Ah Xing watched the man limp away, a strange feeling washed over him. For the first time in months, he felt good. Not the fleeting pleasure of winning at gambling or indulging in vices, but a deep, warm satisfaction. He had used his power to help someone, and it felt great. That night, Ah Xing couldn't sleep. He tossed and turned, thinking about his life and the gift he had been given. I've been wasting this ability, he realized. I could be doing so much more. The next morning, Ah Xing made a decision that would change his life forever. He would become a doctor and use his X-ray vision to help people. It would give his life purpose and put his extraordinary gift to good use. Ah Xing knew it wouldn't be easy. His high school grades had been poor, and he had been out of school for years. But he was determined to succeed. He enrolled in a cram school to prepare for the university entrance exams, focusing solely on medical programs. The first year was tough. Ah Xing studied harder than he ever had before, but when the results came out, he hadn't made the cut. Disappointed but not discouraged, Ah Xing decided to try again. I can do this, he told himself. I have to do this. For another year, Ah Xing threw himself into his studies. This time, his hard work paid off. He was accepted into the medical school at Kaohsiung Medical University. Medical school was challenging, but Ah Xing's unique ability gave him an advantage in anatomy and diagnosis classes. Still, he worked hard to understand the science behind what he could see with his X-ray vision. 
One day, during a clinical rotation, Oshing's professor asked him to examine a patient with a complex fracture. As Oshing looked at the patient's arm, he could clearly see the break, but he knew he couldn't reveal how he knew. I think we should order an X-ray, Oshing said carefully. Based on the swelling and the patient's description of the pain, I suspect there might be a comminuted fracture of the radius. The professor raised an eyebrow. That's a very specific guess, Mr. Ah Xing. What makes you think it's comminuted? Ah Xing thought quickly. Well, the patient described a high-impact fall, and the swelling pattern is consistent with multiple bone fragments. Of course, we'd need an X-ray to confirm. When the X-ray came back, it showed exactly what Ah Xing had described. The professor was impressed. Excellent observation skills, Mr. Ah Xing. You have a bright future in orthopedics. Years passed, and Ah Xing completed his medical degree, followed by his residency in orthopedic surgery. His uncanny ability to diagnose injuries and diseases without scans or tests earned him a reputation as a brilliant diagnostician. Finally, Ah Xing became a renowned orthopedic surgeon. He used his X-ray vision to perform complex surgeries with unprecedented precision, saving countless lives and improving the quality of life for many patients. One day, a young boy was brought into the emergency room after a serious car accident. The boy's parents were distraught. Please, doctor, the mother pleaded, save our son. Ah Xing examined the boy with his X-ray vision. The injuries were severe but he could see exactly what needed to be done. Don't worry, he assured the parents. Your son's injuries are serious, but I believe we can help him. We'll need to operate immediately. After hours in the operating room, Ah Xing emerged, tired but smiling. The surgery was successful, he told the anxious parents. Your son will need time to recover, but he's going to be okay. The parents burst into tears of relief, hugging Ah Xing tightly. Thank you, doctor, the father said. You're a miracle worker. As Ah Xing watched the family reunite in the recovery room, he felt a deep sense of fulfillment. He thought back to that rainy night years ago when lightning had struck him, giving him his extraordinary gift. What had once seemed like a curse, leading him down a path of selfish indulgence, had become his greatest blessing, an ability to help others and give his life meaning. That night, as Ah Xing drove home from the hospital, he smiled to himself. He had found his purpose, and he was using his gift to make the world a better place, one patient at a time. Moral, true happiness and fulfillment come not from using our talents for personal gain, but from using them to help others and make a positive difference in the world. Every gift, no matter how unusual, can be used for good if we choose to do so. 单字, technician 技术员, noun, a worker trained with special skills, especially in science or engineering. Raincoat 雨衣, noun, a coat that protects the wearer against rain. Disposable 一次性的, adjective, a disposable product is intended to be thrown away after use. Bolt 闪电, noun, a flash of lightning that looks like a white line against the sky. Lightning 闪电, Noun. A flash of bright light in the sky that is produced by electricity moving between clouds or from clouds to the ground. Bolt of lightning 一道闪电. Lightning that appears as a white line in the sky. Discharge 允许出院. Verb. To allow someone officially to leave somewhere, especially a hospital or a law court. Mahjong tiles 麻将牌. Mahjong tiles are the playing pieces used in the game of mahjong. Playing card 扑克牌. Noun. One of a set of 52 small, rectangular pieces of stiff paper, each with a number and a design showing one of four suits printed on it, used in games. Thinking, 事实或想法, 逐渐被完全理解, 被充分意识到. Phrasal verb. If an unpleasant or surprising fact or idea sinks in, you gradually start to believe it, understand it, or realize the effect it will have on you. Ecstatic, 欣喜若狂的. Adjective. Extremely happy. Casino, 赌场. Noun. A building where games, especially roulette and card games are played for money. Indulge 是, 沉溺于, 油脂, 放纵. Verb. 
to allow yourself or another person to have something enjoyable, especially more than is good for you. Brothel Tiyuan. Noun. A place where men go and pay to have sex with prostitutes. Clutch, 通常指因恐惧、焦虑或痛苦而紧抓、紧握。Verb. To take or try to take hold of something tightly, usually in fear, worry, or pain. Sprain, 扭伤、关节。Verb. To cause an injury to a joint equals a place where two bones are connected by a sudden movement. Fracture, 骨折。Noun. A break or crack in something hard, especially a bone. Orthopedic clinic, 骨科诊所 Orthopedic, 骨科的 also orthopedic British English adjective, relating to the medical treatment of problems that affect people's bones or muscles. Vis 堕落恶习 Noun, a moral fault or weakness in someone's character. Toss and turn, 由只因无法入睡而翻来覆去 To move about from side to side or turn a lot in bed, especially because you cannot sleep. Enroll 时加入注册 Verb. To put yourself or someone else onto the official list of members of a course, college, or group, make the cut 达到标准或要求 It refers to meeting the minimum requirements or standards to be successful in something. Anatomy, 解剖学 Noun, the scientific study of the body and how its parts are arranged. Clinical rotation, 临床实习 A clinical rotation is a period of practical training for medical students. Radius, 脑骨 Noun. The thicker of the two bones in the lower arm, comminuted fracture, 一粉碎性骨折 A comminuted fracture is when a bone breaks into three or more pieces. Diagnostician, 诊断医师 A diagnostician is a medical doctor who specializes in identifying and determining the nature of a disease or medical condition. Residency, 住院医师的实习期 A period of time when a doctor receives special training in a particular type of medicine, especially at a hospital. Unprecedented, 史无前例的，空前的 Adjective, never having happened or existed in the past.